Hey guys, how's it going? Chez back again with another episode of the England in Rio mini series here on Xbox One. Now, if you missed the previous episode, which came out yesterday, it was the knock of the first knockout round game against Italy. I will leave an annotation on screen, the bottom left hand side of your picture. If you want to go back and check that video out before watching this quarter final, clearly we won, but what was the score? Check it out if you missed it. But so uh, as you can see, we're playing Portugal in the quarterfinals of the Brazil 2014 World Cup. A lot of history between these two. You remember Wayne Rooney getting sent off. Was it Euro 2004 with Ronaldo and the cheeky wink? So well, there's definitely a lot of a lot of history, a lot of bad taste in the mouth between these two sides. But uh, it's definitely going to be a competitive fixture at the very least. But they came close there. William Carvalho having a good second effort after his initial shot was blocked. And uh, there was a lot of space to Joe Hart's right-hand side. So uh, they really could have taken the lead there. But Stevie G gets inside really, really well. And Rui Patricio this time makes a decent save. It's on hand, or he's on hand to, uh, to make a decent decent save and uh, keep the shot out of goal but uh, they play the ball through looking for Adrian Silva they play the ball back to Joe Hart and he just smashes it straight into the guy's face smashes it right straight into Adrian Silva's face rim first half stoppage time a horrible time to concede a goal especially a goal in that fashion we go into the uh, into the break at half time with heads hanging low really low I was extremely angry especially considering we'd been on top they'd had a lot of the ball they were holding on to possession absolutely superbly but as you can see they'd had two previous shots Neither of which were on target, so they're 1-0 up, having not had a shot on target all game. But uh, Cristiano Ronaldo just toyed with me the entire game. Honestly, I could not get the ball off him. Just look at him. Showburton and everything, breaking into the box. Decent shot, and this time Joe Hart makes a good save. And he keeps the ball out of the back of the net, and it stays at 1-0. We're going to get a chance to get ourselves back in it here. And there's a little bit of controversy along with that as well. You see the ball's played through to Ashley Young. Paolo Oliveira is the last man and he pulls this shirt, gives away a foul, the referee gives it, but no card. Surely that is a clear goal scoring opportunity. Ashley Young, all he's got to do is side for that into the back of the net. That should be a red card. I was fuming. Nothing came with the free kick as well, which kind of just overemphasized my anger at the situation. But so uh, we're going to take it in our stride to try and build again. Michael Carrick, this ball, by the way. Oh my days, that is absolutely pinpoint straight into the path of Wayne Rooney. Doesn't have to break stride. Wax it right into the top corner and we're back on level terms just before the hour mark. Looking to uh, to get ourselves in front, but Cristiano Ronaldo again is doing the work inside the box. It's a poor touch from Wilshere and Joe Martino has a shot and Joe Hart takes an absolute age to react to the shot. I just wanted him to just, it wasn't a hard save. He just took forever to dive. If you uh, When you watch the replay, he doesn't actually make a move until the ball's on the six yard line. It's already moved 12 yards before he even decides to dive for it. I was absolutely livid that he just basically didn't take any sort of interest in the shot until you, you'll see. Then he makes a dive. Like, dive earlier, please. So we're 2-1 down and uh, really up against it for the rest of the game. They're actually having a really, really good spell in the game. Ronaldo, again, just killing me on that left-hand side. Plays it all into Moutinho. He's going to get it back into Nelson Oliveira. Unfortunately, his side-footed effort does go wide of the uh, of the far post. But we're trying to get ourselves back in the game desperately. Rooney involved, looking for Theo Walker over the top. Going to try and stand it up into the middle. Is that handball? Should we have had a penalty? That's more controversy. Handball... A penalty shout and a potential red card shout. Another shot here from Wayne Rooney. Is that handball as well? The ball goes out for a goal kick. Takes the deflection off the player's hand. That's two penalty shouts in the space of 60 seconds and a potential red card decision. More controversy. England versus Portugal. It's horrific. Daniel Sturridge with a shot. I want him to take on his left. And he took it with his weak foot and fired it straight at the goalkeeper. And in the uh, towards the end of the game, you just see... I uh, sped this up a little bit because you could just see how, how well Portugal were keeping hold of the ball. I couldn't get near them. And uh, eventually we're going to clear it and they're not going to get a chance. But the whistle goes. And uh, we're actually out of the World Cup now. We do take a defeat from the quarter-final. It's disappointment for England in Brazil 2014. Portugal come out victorious and we are out. We're on the plane home. It's really, really disappointing. I, with, the, uh, with the French... Uh, kind of the French mini series when we uh, we were Tottenham manager on 360, we got to the final and lost. But uh, you can see we had so many chances eight shots, six on target, and Rui Patricio had the game of his life. They did keep possession, as you can see. I uh, showed it actually in game, and you, the stats confirm that as well. So much possession for them. But France beat Spain, as you can see, 2 1 to progress through to the semis. They will play Portugal. Argentina and Uruguay yet to play, as are Germany and Brazil, and that is a massive game. Germany, Brazil in a World Cup quarter final. Two of the uh, two of the favourites coming head to head so early on in the tournament is absolutely huge. So uh, do be sure to leave the video a like, guys, if you did enjoy. I do apologise that we weren't able to get any further in the tournament, but there will be another transfer, a uh, kind of 
latest transfer update coming for you in the Chelsea career mode later on tonight around about 8 o'clock in your sub boxes and it includes a ginormous transfer so do make sure that you see that video because it's massive and I need a lot of feedback from you guys for it. I want to know, I want to gauge the response because uh, it's really, it could be quite controversial but uh, that's going to bring this one to a close guys so please feel free to leave the video a like, subscribe if you haven't, links in the description and annotation top right of your screen and I will see you next time.